Okay, here is my 12 by 12, my last 12 by 12 in Maine. And uh, here's my setup. And this trip I use, you know, everybody has millions of equipment. That's what I use for today. I'm gonna use this uh, Centrail. Um, kind of inexpensive panel, but uh, I'm not a, mm, love them because they're very slippery. But that's all I have for today. Let's see. Um, what can I do with it? Um, I can see the fog is rolling away, so I have to do some numbery stuff. Well, it's already looks totally different now because the, uh, uh, here it's very funny the fog just rolling away rolling from place to place really fast I don't feel the wind but they like hunting fog going really fast but uh, I just have to do from half a memory half of I didn't draw, I draw it in my head. This is left over from yesterday. Well, I don't know how long my cell is stable or not. If you lost, I'll come back later. Second gray. my uh, um, the lever of um, other power. Okay, I can do without, I guess. It's not here. It's okay. Recently, I really like this brush from Rosemary to start. They give you soft stuff. The fog going down. Now they come back in again. It's funny. Fog. I paint the fog yesterday. It's so much fun. You just have to be quick.
See, this is too dark for the fog. But that area, almost my dark is too dark. This is better. Darker's the dark is right here. Not far here, so more solid. Try to be quick, 40 minutes the most. 30 minutes will be better. Because I, yesterday I did like three 30 minutes stuff. Really fun. Here's that church. I was gonna paint somewhere else until I saw this. This is gone. This is leaving me. So uh, the fog is going. So I'm gonna try to do here first. So here, um, doesn't matter what that is. Just color shapes. Screen your eye, don't see the details. If you don't screen, you're gonna catch into the. Um... <laughs> Not for the camera. <laughs> Not really. Not my fault. Okay, the water is dark value, darker value. Actually, more neutral. The sky is warmer. The slightly value difference for today because of the fog. But the water a lot cooler. So here, this area, all those boats, is crystal clear. Here's the fog, so it rolling through. So if I want to, if I have time, 
If I want to spend any time, I'm going to spend it here because there's a mysterious part. So I'm going to change the brush and have a little corner. I mean, I really don't have a interest to rendering them. I just want to get a, a feeling of this place. That's what I'm really after in my studies. I I have no intent to just you know copy that place and uh, and to paint exactly the same. I just put my feeling about this place down there. That's the goal. Everybody have different goals. Some people want to do finish the painting. I just want to have a quick fun. So here, not much fog. So color, pretty clear over there. Here's one. See, think about the blue rhythms right here. Here's a sail somewhere. In this point, the, the, the top roof of the church is really exactly the same value of the background, just slightly uh, warmer, more purple right here. I don't even need to have to paint that if I don't want to, because it's there. Um, so, thinking in terms of shapes. Well, if you like my video, you can go to my website hiyoho.com I have other videos there for free go to the video section I also have some at chessbigfineartstudio.com and over there are more fun because not only mine other instructors video free video as well it's a free sign up Here is already have enough information for it's really you know quick, and I just all I need to do just dab couple. My goal is to finish in no more than forty minutes. The better is thirty minutes. So this tell you here more important for you to look than anywhere else. Here's a boat. Actually, here has a building, but it's not important at all to me. Here's a little boat. Here is a sailboat right here. You don't have to put everything in. You choose what, whatever you want to put in. It's thinking of the rhythm. So change my brush to have square over there to This much, in this point, I'm pretty much done here. Just a little, you know, just a little study.
couple little buoys. I mean, those little uh, teeny buoys, and then um, don't put them everywhere. Thinking of where to help you compose, where you need it. You don't have to copy them where they exactly at because they're all over the place actually. It just my dirty brush, by the way. So I keep this bigger one. Do I need that one? If I don't need it, you don't put it in. And I don't normally like to, I don't like it at all to touch my brush, uh, touch my studies. And I think in my uh, uh, lighter area, the, how the light composes, how light travels. I'm talking about the light va lighter value, not the light, because there's not much light today. And the church actually, so much cooler color than I have. See, I want to, my most of contracts is right here, and the top is in. And here, really not important for me, important is here. I love to leave all those things. And in this point, in this study, pretty much done. I don't need all those uh, little shit everywhere. Sorry. Um, so, I think I, I in about a half hour, this painting. So I'm gonna sign it. And to keep it, I don't normally touch what I study. So, see all those spots of leaf, and the, and the, I could use blue to sign here, or I could use red. And maybe in this case here, look at my blue, maybe there's three. So, how to balance all those colors? I probably sign maybe blue here. Change my mind. Or purple. And I use the signature tool. I, I love to leave this because I think that's really cool. Oh, I don't like it. So. Change my mind. Go red again. I use my signature. I don't use only one color. Most of the signature is try to work out with the balance of the color. Wondering. So you look at the red. I could put here, but I don't like over there. I still like to be here. So. Okay, done. See you later. I'm gonna paint. Uh, a lighthouse later. See you later.